And we're back. So, we're back with this again. I just saw the recording start. So, just to make sure, I had to make sure the recording was starting, you know. Leave us alone for a minute. The Colombian cartel is making spanks somewhere in Liberty, but we don't know where. And they seem to know everything we're doing before we do. We got us a rat. Oh, 6 the nine. Named Curly Bob works the bar at Luigi's. He's been throwing more money around than he's earning. He ain't pimping or pushing, so he must be talking. Damn straight. He's a taxi home after work, so follow him. And if he's ratting us out, kill him. Damn, so we gotta go kill a 6 9 Nice. Gotta go put out the rats, you know? Put out the rats to pasture. Park out the front of Luigi's Club. Curly Bob will be leaving shortly. Do I have to use one of those shitty cars? Can I use one of your cars? Your cars are kind of nice. These cars are kind of... Kind of mint, you know? I, I might already use the Mafia Sentinel. This is kind of... Kind of nice right here. Oh, that guy's dead. Well, when in Rome... There we go. Holy crap. You know what? One second, one second. Free money, man. I, what? Look at that. Oh, my God. Look at all this money. Look at all this money. Oh, man. What a what a nice day. Look at all that money. Free money. Oh, I was trying to hit that dude with the fucking giant cone. And I missed. All right. So, which way is it? It's a nice, swift right right here. Okay. Or I just drive into the staircase like an idiot. That, that kind of works, too, you know? Yeah, I, I was about to try doing a ramp for some reason, even though I don't, I don't need to do that. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Man, you guys are on the wrong side of the street today. Is there a paint spray somewhere right here, just so I can get these cops off me? Because I do not want to deal with cops, especially while I'm trying to tail somebody. All right, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, because you, you can't, it has the spooko meter and all that, you know? Alright, so do I just... Alright, so I gotta just uh, stay back. Don't be too close to him, you know? Oh, God. He started suspecting something right there. Alright, so he's telling, he's going up here to the right. So what, can I not just like speed up too fast? Is that the thing? Hopefully he doesn't notice that me just like swerving in and out of traffic is, you know. That, you saw how fast that spookle meter thing filled up at first though? That's crazy. That thing filled up in like half a second just for me fucking barely tapping the gas. And then I just like stood still and I didn't know what to do. I'm guessing I can't be right behind, even though this is kind of shadier than if I was actually. I guess just follow him now. Oh. Alright, come on. Do I have to, like, physically follow him? Okay. So am I supposed to like, keep following him, or like, what's happening here? What, what's going on right here? Why are these dudes just like walking? I thought the guy who walked out of the car is the actual guy, but I guess not. Oh, okay. There he is. Here comes our little friend, Mr. Big Mouth himself. Were you followed? You know what goes on here is our little secret, Amit. No, no, I, I wasn't followed. You got my stuff? All right, Cracker, you weren't followed by us. I followed you. Not talk. Okay, so the Leones are fighting wars on two fronts. They're in a turf war with the triads, with no sign of either side giving up. Meanwhile, Joey Leone has stirred up some bad blood with the Forellis. Every day they're losing men and influence in the city. This dude's a crackhead. He sniffs he between every sentence. And with loyalty like yours, what has he possibly got to worry about? Well, I'm going to take this dude out real quick. Whack Curly Bob. You know, maybe we should have whacked all of them in the first place. That would have probably been good. All right, Curly Bob. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thanks for that, Curly Bob. You know, we probably should have taken out the other people before he told them, but, you know, 
I guess that's too difficult. Yeah, your boy's dead, so nice. No more Curly Bob to worry about. Tony, work for you. Oh, nice. Tony's got some more work for me. All right. Well, let's go save this real quick. Just because uh, I don't want to have to redo this again. God forbid. You know, this is why I save between every little fucking thing. Because you never know when something can go wrong. You know what I mean? So let's at least save up here. And then we'll be good to go. Whoops. My bad. You're in the wrong place at the wrong time, my friend. Wrong place, wrong time. Alright, let's hop in. I'm gonna keep this car. This car is actually kinda, kinda mint. Alright, cool. Car's good. Let's let that get fixed up. And then we'll just, uh, save a Rooney. Nice. Only been recording for five minutes on the second one, so I might as well keep recording. I like doing the longer episodes, but doing the longer episodes has a bigger risk of uh, the recording just getting lost, so I can't really do that all the time. Alright, so uh, who, who's calling me? Import, export, Portland Harbor. Uh, we have orders for various vehicles. Check our notice board for requirements All right. yeah I think I'm gonna do a Tony mission instead so uh yeah you fuck you dude you almost hit me all right let's uh hop out the mafia car and let's go see what Tony's got for us here triads and tribulation I don't think I've done this I'm finally on new shit again we're at war the triads have a fish factory as a front most of their business goes down at the fish market in Chinatown the laundry still owes us protection. They reckon the triads are protecting them now, so I say we exact a fitting punishment. Take those boys over and whack the triad warlords. Hell, if you get a chance, pop some of their soldiers, too. Damn. Fucking Carver is ruthless around here. Oh, these are my boys? Are you guys coming with me? Oh, look at these dudes. These dudes are... Look at these guys. These guys are fucking a hoss. Look at them. They're gonna fuck people up. We're gonna fuck some people up. Look at this. We got this little group here. Oh, hell yeah. Come on, where's that last guy at? Where's the last guy at? Wasn't there another dude? I could have sworn there was another guy in a suit. But, uh, I guess it doesn't matter, right? I mean, is it this guy? Isn't he my... Aren't you my partner, my guy? I'm pretty sure this dude was my partner. Alright, I guess not. I guess it's only these two guys. Fuck it, right? So let's go to wherever the fuck we're going to, to kill his soldiers and whatever. There's a bunch of dudes in black suits on the street. I keep thinking they're like my guys. They probably are my guys, but I don't know. The city's just a bunch of fucking gunfire every three seconds. All right, that was easy enough. Yeah, done. Go on, get up. Oh my God, what the hell? Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, this is... Oh my God, I died. I did not... Okay, I was not prepared for that. I don't know what I was expecting. Let me listen to this cutscene again. We're at war. The Triads have a fish factory as a front. Most of their business goes down at the fish market in Chinatown. The laundry still owes us protection. They reckon the Triads are protecting them now, so I say we exact a fitting punishment. Take those boys over and whack the Triad Warlords. Hell, if you get a chance, pop some of their soldiers, too. But yeah, this guy is dead-ass Carver from uh, The Walking Dead Season 2. Pretty sure. So, man, look at these dudes. These dudes are like Spider-Man. Like, Alright, anybody else want to hop in to go on the ride? Nope. Alright, cool. Really, man? man? These people are idiots, bro. They just clog the streets like it's nothing, like... We don't got time for that, bro. Uh, yoink! I don't know who I'm running over, but that guy's... Those two are dead. Dead Reno for sure, bro. <laughs> Alright, yep, there we go. Cool. They're dead. There we go. Anyone else wanna... 
try some shit. Oh, okay. We got this guy over here. We got these fucking idiots. All right, you wanna? All right. Yeah, come on. Come on. Yeah, keep running me over. Let's see how that works. Let's see how that works out for you. Let's see how that works out for you. Let's see how that works out for you, fucking idiots. Let's see how that works out for you, idiot. Oh my god, dude. Can't do shit. Can't do shit. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I'm killing all your boys. You can't do jack, dude. These guys are lame. Oh my god, what the fuck? Boom. Man, I'm slaughtering these dudes right now. This, it sucks you can't shoot out of the car. That kind of is annoying. But, uh, yeah. Oh, now I'm wanted. Ah, sh oh, God. Get the fuck out of the car. Get the fuck out of the car. Get the... <laughs> Get out of the car, my guy. Yeah, this is not the time for that. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, you're dead. All right, cool. Dead, dead, dead. Three dead guys. Let's go up here. Oh, my God, dude. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, my God, dude. Why are you shooting at me? I thought we were friends. Why did my own guy just fucking kill me? Unless they weren't my guys and they were just some random fucking people. That would suck. <sighs> Fuck. Alright, let's try that again. I'm not sure where I'm really going wrong in all of this. You know, maybe we'll take a truck this time and then, uh... You know, alright, let's take the truck. Can you hop in the back or something, my guy? I guess not. All right. Well, I guess we'll take a van. This is only two seats. Can I take this? Can you hop in the back? I guess not. What the fuck, dude? Oh, my God. Are you... <sighs> you know, let me just save this right now. Just make sure it's still going on. We'll, we'll redo that again.